more than 73 years after Gandhi came to Noakhali to calm the raging riots, his presence remains alive in the area. The Gandhi Ashram Trust, set up in 1946, continues to carry forward the work of Gandhiji through its various activities. In 1946, a terrible communal riot took place at Noakhali before the partition of India Pakistan. So Gandhiji rushed to Noakhali at the age of um, 76, and he was uh, very sick at that time. And Gandhiji came to Noakhali on 7th November 1946 and stayed in Noakhali about four months. He visited about 49 villages and talked with the local community, Hindus, Muslims, and people from other religions. And he became successful to establish peace among the communities, Hindus, Muslims, and others. And Gandhiji, when he visited Noakhali, he visited this Gandhi Ashram on 29th January 1947. And he stayed here for one night, and next day he left for next village. Before he leaving, he inaugurated a basic school for the poor students of the area, which is now known as Gandhi Memorial Institute. Students from class 1 to 10 is getting education from here with free of cost. Time, the uh, owner of this land, Barrister Hemanto Kumar Ghosh, he donated all his lands and properties in the name of Gandhi and it was registered in 1949 to continue the Gandhi's desired activity in this area. But uh, uh, after uh, 47, after uh, India-Pakistan uh, separation, and especially after the assassination of Gandhiji, most of the Gandhians left Noakhali, ex except a few. And those who are staying at this place, Diden East Pakistan, they were in a very miserable condition. Most of them are kept in jail for a long time. Four people are outside of jail and they are killed by the Pakistani army. So there is a very painful history of the Gandhians of this portion. Despite serious challenges, the Gandhi Ashram Trust has carried on the constructive work in line with Gandhian philosophy with support from various agencies including Government of India and others. Gandhi Ashram uh, Trust has uh, many uh, different uh, programs and uh, projects, uh, good governance and human rights program, peace building initiatives, uh, Khadi uh, advocacy and campaign on Gandhi philosophy. Uh, Gandhi, Mahatma Gandhi ji uh, is uh, still now alive in our hearts. Uh, he is alive in uh, through our activities. Director of the Gandhi Ashram Trust, Raha Navakumar, explained some of the plans for the future of the ashram and the Gandhian activities he wants to undertake in the future. The youths of Bangladesh, uh, especially the present, present generation, uh, they are gradually wanted to know about Gandhi, but previously, uh, uh, they don't have any interest uh, to know uh, because uh, because uh, in our uh, textbooks when we studied in the schools, college, even university, there was no nothing about Gandhiji. But nowadays there is something is coming up. People are discussing on Gandhi, as well as Gandhi Strong Trust and other Gandhi organizations in Bangladesh are also working to promote Gandhi philosophy. So there are a lot of challenges in this field because. Uh, there are a lot of school of thoughts is working in area, especially the fundamentalist groups, those who are promoting the uh, religious fundamentalism in the subcontinent. They are working in this area also. It is necessary to strengthen our activities and I think it is necessary to expand our activities because it is our experience that youth are interested to know about Gandhiji, but I should go with the masses. So I should reach them. Uh, it is very essential to establish some uh, center of excellence so where people can run, study, and uh, research on Gandhi. And this will help to attract a young generation 
on Gandhi philosophy and his activities. And Gandhi Ashram Trust is thinking like that to establish a center of excellence so young generations will get uh, benefit from it. Gandhi Ashram Trust had been built by the sacrifices of legendary Gandhians of Bangladesh like Padma Shri, late Jharna Dhara Chaudhuri. It is the time people and organizations across the world come forward to strengthen the institutions like Gandhi Ashram Trust to spread the message of peace, non-violence and communal harmony in the strife-torn world of today. Rajesh Jha for DD News and AIR News, Noah Khali, Bangladesh.